Whitefish Bulldogs boys and girls soccer team both just won their respective Class A state titles. The second time both teams have won it in the same year and the first time since 2006 that they're able to call Whitefish the city of champions. Definitely been fun being a state champion. It can't always can't always say that, but but it's been it's been nice. McPherson was the hero for the Bulldogs as his second half goal gave them a 1-0 win to secure the program's 10th Class A state title. And he gives all the credit to one thing. Super strong brotherhood. We never really, even when we were tied in that final game, we never really just lost faith in each other. We just, we knew we'd get the goal eventually. Goalkeeper Ethan Bork had never played soccer until this year and somehow wound up starting and winning a state championship. And he knows his Hollywood story is something special. These guys recruited me to be their goalkeeper. Uh, it was an awesome experience, super fun. It's great to come out here, learn how to play soccer. And uh, never played before. I've never played soccer before, and it was, it was super fun. Loved it. While overjoyed with their own win, the first thing the boys did on the bus ride home was watch the girls' game. We had a streaming session just in the back of the bus, cheering them on, uh, watching the goals. Super fun, high energy, just excited that they also got to experience the same thing we had. About 30 minutes before kickoff in the girls' game, it was announced that the boys had won their state title, and it only added fuel to the fire. It was really cool to know that they won and I feel like it kind of just gave us a little more like Whitefish needs to dominate. After losing last year's state title in a close two to one overtime game, the girls went into this one with a chip on their shoulder. Our coach said it to us multiple times, like I don't have to cultivate a belief in you guys, like you guys know that you guys can win. And I think that's true. I think we 100% every single person stepped on the field knowing that we had that game and we were willing to do anything to prove that. Fellow senior Isabel Cook, who scored what would eventually be the game winner late in the first half, knows it couldn't have been a more surreal way to finish her high school career. Once the whistle blew, it just didn't feel real. Um, we were all just so excited and I didn't know how to react, like working towards that for the last four years. And finally getting to that moment was just an incredible feeling. The Bulldogs plan to continue taking in their championship wins and then gear up for next year to defend their titles. In Whitefish, Carter Culver, MTN Sports.